Villanova's home, and I'm seeing a whole lot of orange. Yeah. Syracuse, Syracuse travels tra well. Oh, yeah. Cuse fans are everywhere. So how, how long was the drive to get here? Uh, about five hours. Rain, terrible weather. It took me six and a half hours last night. Uh, three hours. Four, four, and a half, four and a half hours. Five, it's going to take six and a half with the ice storm. Drove for horrible weather about five hours. No disrespect to Villanova, but a little bit more tradition at, at the Cuse. I go to the Dome all the time. I don't see a lot of Nova fans there. And I see more Cuse fans here in this house than I see Cap fans. I see a lot of orange in here tonight. What do you What do you think about that? I don't like it because there's too many of them. We need a cheer louder or something to balance it out. It's a wildcat versus an orange man. Wildcat will literally eat out the orange man's heart. He'll take it and he'll eat it. You feeling any uh, sort of hostility in this section here? A little bit, but I mean, I look at the scoreboard and they're up five, so. <laughs> now, every place you go, are there a lot of orange? Is there a lot of orange in the crowd? This is the most I've seen at a away game. This is very simple. Does it make you feel good? It makes me feel real good. How far would you guys travel for cute? As far as we need to go. We've been to Arizona for an SU game. Florida. Rhode Island. UMass. UVA, West Virginia, UMass. Notre Dame, Rutgers, Louisville. We're going, we're going to the Final Four. We made the tournament. We're going to the Final Four. All the way to Alamo. 